Good morning. In this session, let's discuss about a first passage probability. By first passage probability, we mean the conditional probability that the system visit one of the state for the first time after some transition, given the information that the system was at some stage. Clear? Once again, by first passage probability, we mean the conditional probability that the system visit one of the state for the first time after some transition, given the information that the system was at some stage. And n step first passage probability, probability usually denoted by F I J N F I J N Here F I J N is equal to probability that the system reaches J th state system reaches J th state For the first time, J at the state, for the first time, for the first time after starting from I in N transition. After starting from I in N transition. That is probability of xn equal to j, xn minus 1 not equal to j, etc. x1 not equal to j, given x not equal to i. The first passage may be computed based on elementary probability result. But the computation is a tedious method. So we adopt the following method. Relation between Fijn and Pijn. We consider the event corresponding to Pijn. It may be split into number of mutually exclusive cases. First one, to start from I, start from I reaches J for the first time in one step and then reaches J in n minus one steps with the probability Fi. J1, PJJ, N minus 1. PJJ, N minus 1. Clear? What is this? To start from I reaches J for the first time in one step and then reaches J in N minus 1 steps with probability FIJ1, PJJ, N minus 1. And the second case, what is that? To start from I reaches J for the first time in two steps. Then reaches J in N minus two steps. With the probability F I J to P J J N minus two. Or in general, to start from I reaches J for the first time in R steps and reaches J in N minus R steps with the probability F I J R P J J N minus R. Clear? To start from I reaches J for the first time in R step and reaches J in N minus R steps with the probability F I J R P J J N minus R. 
then P I J N is equal to sigma over R F I J R P J J N minus R. Therefore, what is P I J 1? P I J 1 equal to F I J 1. Then what about P I J 2? P I J 2 equal to F I J 1 P J J 1 plus F I J 2. Then what about P I J 3? P I J 3 equal to F I J 1 P J J 2 plus F I J 2 P J J 1 plus F I J 3. Clear? Next we have to consider the probability generating function. Consider the n step transition probability. Consider the n step transition probability Pijn and first passage probability Fijn. The PGF of the transition probability Pijn is denoted by Pijs. PGF is denoted by Pijs. And is defined as Pijs is equal to sigma n equal to 0 to infinity s raised to n Pijn. Hence, Pijn can be obtained as the coefficient of s raised to n in Pijs. The PGF of first passage probability may be defined as F i j s that is equal to sigma n equal to 0 to infinity s raised to n f i j n. It may be noted that noted that p i j not equal to 0 P J J not equal to 1, F I J not equal to 0, and F J J not equal to 0. Clear? Thank you.